So welcome back to Hermitcraft Creative. As you can see, compared to last time, I found myself a texture pack. Two, actually. Which, I'll put them down in the description. But I have the Flows HD 128 times, which I might go and downgrade that to the 64 if it's too laggy when I'm recording. But then I also have the Invictus mod pack, which is basically, um like a Sortex fanver type thing for the mods. So the reactor has a little bit of a different texture. This looks a little different. Whereas all the Minecraft stuff like this is 128. So it looks so much smoother and I love it already. So I did a little playing around between parts. I, as you see, I have a hole over here now. This is actually leads to the outside. This is where my power cable is going to come out of the mountain to power everything down there and then everything that's going to be over there. I'll figure that out eventually, but this is going to be my first... Let's get a light in here. This is going to be my first um, power exit. Sorry, I couldn't think of what I was trying to say. So I did a little bit of playing around and I figured out how I'm going to do everything with my cabling, like for my power tap, up and around into here with my power blocks, which I'm going to be using the energy cubes for mechanism. Which, yet again, I also had to play with those to make sure I remembered how they worked. But what we're actually going to do... Why do I have saplings in my inventory? Ilaria, make sure I have what I need here. Alright, so right now we're going to... And I turned the reactor on a couple times to make sure it was actually going to work. We're going to clear this out around here. Oh, that needs to change. Uh, it's this one, right? I hope it's this one. Okay, good. It, it was that one. Oops. Alright, get that all lined up. And then we clear through there. Make sure I can reach. There we go. And this is what I have covers for. Oh, they're, they're oh so nice. Sadly, these Botania blocks didn't have any covers, so I had to go something else to make it look a little different. So these will essentially hide all of the blocks, all of the, the cables. Like so. See how it works? You just have to be very careful with how you place things, because if you place it in the wrong spot, you can cut your cable off. Let me show you. If I place that right uh, there, it didn't go in the right spot. Okay, let me try the other side. I mean, it went in the right spot, but that's not what I wanted to show. Oh, it's actually not going to do it. Okay, but I'll show you here. If you place it vertically by accident, it will, it acts as kind of like a buffer between the pieces, which can be useful in some cases. But right now, we just want blocks to hide this stuff. And there is actually a, let me see if I can find it real quick. Uh, and we want stone, white frequency. And where is it? I think it's this one? That's glowstone. Oh, I want colored stone. Let's try to find that real quick. What color? Hollow stone cover. That's what I want. <clears throat> to essentially do this with. To make it look like an actual cable that goes into the wall. It's very convenient. I'll probably be using those these covers a lot more. Coming in here, it's not that big a deal because, I mean, it's just a power room. So, no big deal with that. But what I'm going to be doing with my power storage, it's a lot of these blocks. And basically, every side, all eight of the sides that don't have this piece on it, except power. This piece exports the power. So I'm going to create, essentially create, a giant wall of these. That's my goal, at least. Um, 
Hold on, if I do it this way, and then this way, and then this way, and then this way is gonna be a problem. Hmm. Maybe I won't do along the top. Let's put them on this row. That way I can zigzag the power through. So essentially this one down here, put it the right way, will acquire all the power first, and then, you know, this one beside it, then this one, then this one, and so forth. Because it's going to go in there, but zigzag all the way through down to here. So, I'm going to try something new. I'm going to actually try to fast forward the video. Find a little, like, music type thing to play through. So, if that doesn't work, um, when I come back and start talking again, I'm going to... Um, if I can't get it to work, it's just going to be a cut. I mean, you guys will figure it out. So, I'm going to go ahead and do this. So, hold on. All right, we are all back. We are back. Hopefully I was able to get that to speed up so you could see me placing, actually placing all of them. Now, I didn't use my builder's wand because it's gonna, I had to place them a certain way. And you saw me, <clears throat> excuse me, you saw me with my wrench here. Now what the wrench does, essentially you can right click with it. It's a crescent hammer. I'm sorry. You can right click with it and it will change which direction it's oriented. So that's that's what I was doing with this block here and that block, I'm sorry, that block on the top and that block over there. I had to get down underneath them so I could see the bottom of them. Alright, so we have a moment of truth here. Make sure everything is working. And now the power should be leaking through and this one is getting power but there's a new problem I gotta turn it on that might help and we are gaining power we have success we have power storage and the cool thing about these they're animated as they get power this little square in the circle that just appeared if we can see it will get darker the more power it gains so of course, when this one fills up, then this one's going to start to fill up. Then this one, then this one, then this one. And then it's going to zigzag all the way through. Apparently, it's not draining fast enough. So this one seems to be gaining power as well. But it's going through everything else. So they should eventually meet somewhere in the middle, getting filled up then. You see how that's getting darker now? Because it's half full. It's awesome. Alright, now we're going to run our first cable, our first power cable, outside here. Eh, eh, I can't fit. I'm too fat. Okay. I want to... I need some dirt and some stone. I don't need you or you. Give me that and that. So I can at least cover this up some. Make it look kind of, like, natural-ish. There we go. At least it's blocked in. But you can still access, if needed. Which, you know, you shouldn't need to, but, yeah, just in case, you never know. That's actually almost full already. That shows you how efficient this reactor is. Look at that. 31,000 RF per tick. I'm sorry. Yeah, 31,000 RF per tick and I think a tick is like a second that's that's a lot of power so hopefully I won't have any issues with long-term power storage that's what I'm hoping for at least all right moment of truth with my lagginess here now that I'm outside and there's more spawned in I did turn my render distance down a little bit like, if I play by myself, I'm good, but right now, oh, actually, I'm actually running at 80, 100, 130, 118, okay. I take that back. I am running at incredible FPS for such a high-def texture pack, which that's a good thing. So, my next issue is trying to figure out what to do next. So, hold on while I try to figure that one out. Alright, guys, I'm back. I think I figured something out. Remember how I said this was going to be like a manager's office up here? That's what I'm going to do. That way I can focus on finishing the reactor and then I'm going to focus on other stuff. 
So I'm gonna work on cleaning this up. Oh, I like that, how that, that's textured. I got the texture pack, but and I saw that the stone and dirt and gravel looked good, but I haven't seen a lot of the ores yet, so that works. Okay. Sorry, I got distracted. Alright, so I'm gonna try the little fast forward thing again while I'm clearing this up some. <clears throat> Hopefully it works, like I said, so I will be back in a second. Alright guys, I'm back. <clears throat> so, I'm sure you probably laughed like I did when I fell through to the reactor below. Um, because I didn't realize that that was going to be a straight drop when I cleared that. But anyway, so I was looking around and this actually opens up back down to below here. Okay. So this is going to be like the main entrance, like you come in, bosses come in here type thing. And they're going to have a, a way down to the reactor below right here, which we built last time. Which will take you down to the reactor. They can make sure nothing's going to go boom. That kind of thing. The blood moon is rising. Okay, so we're just going to ignore that. It just means everything's going to get a little red for a little bit. So, I did figure out I want nice, dark, rich. Because, I mean, come on now. It's a manager's office. They're going to be... Oh. That's a hole. Okay. So, instead of doing that, we'll do it this way and make it so this is kind of like a step up. Why am I doing it like that? Yeah, you see how everything's getting red? Hopefully it doesn't get too dark either. I'm going to throw some torches around. Not like that's really going to help, but so the easy way. All right. That, that looks like a nice executive office's floor. I'm just saying. Just throwing that one out there. It is really dark. Hey, that's right. I'm in creative. Let's do it the easy way. <laughs> Derp. Alright, so this is going to be like a step down and then this can be another step down to get to the ladder, which will take him down to where he needs to go. Uh, what do we want to do for the walls? Let's see what kind of iron designs we have here. Iron bricks? Where's that? Colored bricks, white frequency, nah. What do these look like? Clean? No. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. See, that's too shiny to be a wall. Fancy iron brick. The chisel mod is in here, isn't it? Seriously? I don't have any chisel. Chisel stuff? Chisel. Chisel. Chisel too? No? Okay. Well, I apparently have some kind of chisel something in here. Small cobble tiles. That's... Let's try this one. Oh, now that I like. Um, clear you, put you there. Yeah, that I like. I like that. Yeah, we'll do that for the walls here. So, entrance here. Yeah, entrance can be there. Alright, so that's going to be our walls. Our ceiling is going to get these really bright blocks in it. Just because they are super bright and I love them. Make sure I don't fall through to the ground anymore. Alright, let's get our walls built. I love using the builder's wand when it wants to work for me. Like, that would have been bad if I clicked that. Because then I would have had to destroy all of them. Same thing with this side. Boom. 
All right, now for the ceiling. Hmm, do I want to build up the mountain to where it looks like it's just, you know, kind of cut out type thing? I think I do, to be honest. Because it's kind of lined up over here, but I can build up the mountain around it. Yeah, let's actually do that. I like that idea. I just got to figure out how to do it now. All right, there's that. See, this this having this wand will help me try to contour these things, which I'm not really the best at, you know, landscaping. Dude, what is- dirt, grass, dirt, okay. It looks a totally different color and I don't really like that too much. Let's just make some steps over here, some- some loose stuff. Alright, there's that. Although, I could keep this open as a pathway. And then put steps down. Mm. Hold on. Uh, inspiration is somewhat striking. Ah, that's a fall. Alright, so stairs. How far back would they go? Back to here. That could work. I have stairs looping up and around. I have like double steps. Like, there we go. Get the, the steps. There we go. And then this would be steps going up the rest of the way. Yeah, I'll do that instead. Oh, that's dirt, not stone. There we go. Okay. Hmm. So yeah, these are going to be stairs coming up. This is going to be like a landing. And then we're going to have another one set step coming up over here. And our entrance is going to be right here. Did I really just center that without even trying? One, two, three, four, one. Holy crap, I did. Not bad. Sino, you played Minecraft way too much. Uh, I need to get down there. Let me down. So I can get to this side. Like so. Alright. So let's go back down here. We're going to... I think we're going to dig this out. Just one more level deep. And that should put me... Do I want to go one more? No, if I go one more, I'll have to dig all of this out, and that's... Yeah, I don't want to do that. So now, what do we need? We need some stairs, and since we're outside, I want to use different kind of stairs. So, because the stairs I use here, I'm going to try to use all throughout town. That's, that's what I'm hoping for. So do I want dark stuff? I need to clear out some of my inventory. Oh! No, 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 no. Go away. Go away. I don't know what I did, but go away. Like, like, what did I... Seriously, what did I do that brought that up? I didn't touch anything other than click. Weird. I did it again. Go away. Is it because I'm click- I'm- oh, there we go. I'm clicking that, trying to give them to myself, and it doesn't like that too much. I don't know if I'll need any more of you. We'll keep you out. You can go... Ladder... I think I'm done everything in there. We do want to keep the gravel stone and whatever. Glow block, I want to keep that. Iron doors will keep. You can go away. Goodbye. See ya. Toodaloo. 
you, I'll keep you, well, yeah, I know what I need for the reactor, so we're good, we're good. Alright, inventory is now clear. I was accumulating way, um, what am I doing? I was accumulating way too much stuff. So, what kind of paths do I want? That's my question. That's the problem I may have. What does this look like? Now, what is the... The accompanying blocks look like? Polished limestone. No, this is limestone, right? Yeah, limestone stairs. Oh, there we go. Small limestone with ornate panel. Let's try a couple of these. Hmm. This one actually matches the steps. Okay, so that's a good thing. But does this one... I did not want all 64 of them... You can go away. I want you. Do you match up? No. Hmm. I'm trying to think. Let me try this one. This one. Yes, it does. But do I want, like, a yellow brick road style, whatever, to do a couple damaged? Because I like the damaged looking ones. That's not too bad. And then with the steps, because I have steps, we can have damaged steps and... Where is it? Is it this one? I think, I think it's this one. Yeah, it's that one. Okay. We got ourselves figured out for pathways. Awesome. Yes, yeah, some of them I'll throw this, you know, damaged one down just because I can for some mini detail. Oh, I need a block there. There we go. And I'm probably, I'm actually going to go ahead and end off because, yeah, I've been playing for a while and what I'm going to be doing next time is actually starting on some paths. I know, right? So, I'm gonna end this off. Actually, no, I take that back. I'm not gonna be starting on paths. So you can uh, sit still for a little bit longer. I'm going to be decorating. I'm going to become interior decorator next episode. So if you wanna see how badly that fails, be sure to hit the subscribe button. And I will see you all next time. Bye!